Hey guys, today will be just informative video for uh, some of you working on Mercedes if you have to pull engine out, something like that, uh, or you need to remove wiring harness, but engine usually comes with the wiring harness on Mercedes. We're demonstrating on that uh, W163 ML320 guys and let us show you now, we're going to pull the engine, we need to do transmission replacement, we don't have the no, we don't have a lift at that shop here, so we're just gonna go ahead and uh, pull it out with the engine, easier to be honest with you. That model is pretty easy to work on something, so first you need to disconnect the battery, okay? Disconnect the battery, and next uh, you see all the, all the wires that go here, it's, it's almost uh, impossible to pull them out unless you want to spend an hour or two. So when you chase the wires, you can see that's the bundle, the whole bundle, it goes there, so most likely, it comes to the box right here guys you can see to to the fuse box so we'll see uh, usually you can disconnect them okay like that you'll be able to get to it now we'll need to uh, usually you need to get a, a T socket like this one T20 okay and we need to remove a couple of screws almost all Mercedes vehicles newer ones are like that so you can pull the engine with the wiring harness that way you don't damage any wires, you don't spend so much time trying to pull wires. Okay, the one there now. I think we have one more. Okay, like that, let's see if we can pull that cover off. Okay, just like that. You can see where all the wires are now. Right here. And we're gonna, okay, we're going to uh, chase the ones that we need and they come from over there. So uh, you can see it will definitely be these two, okay? So in order uh, to remove those, like this one, you press down here and push it, okay? But uh, one thing about it is you need to start, okay, hold on a second, you need to start on this right here, remove this one, and you need to start in, in order to remove them from here. So if you remove the middle one, okay, like that, perfect. Okay, now you need to start like that and you can start pulling them out you cannot get them confused after that because they just go in a specific specific way there okay and uh, next we'll need to remove that one there as well super easy the way they designed that okay and now we just need that one there okay and you can see uh, this should be all the wires now for the engine management. Uh, we might actually have two more underneath there, we'll see. Okay, so we'll just uh, free up some space and see what else we have there. Okay, that's one of them. Gone, and now we have, uh, we have, okay, this one right here now. You can see, uh, let me get some light because sun is in the way. Okay, I'm almost, almost done with it. Okay, you also have a ground wire somewhere in that pile of wires there that goes to the engine. And uh, another thing, you have a direct positive cable from the battery all the way to the alternator right here. So you need to take care of that one, you need to disconnect it. In our case, you can either take it off from here and there, or just the alternator on the back, usually it's with only one nut. And only one wire positive on the starter. So that will be, that will be the whole thing, guys. Okay, right, guys, and we have the wiring harness out of the way, and now it just goes with the engine. You can see, pretty simple, instead of spending so much time trying to disconnect everything in the way, the Mercedes vehicles are designed. Uh, you can see everything holds with little bolts, nuts here and there, the wiring harness, so it's really, really hard to remove it. Uh, we had a second ground wire there, but uh, that will be, guys, the whole procedures. Okay, guys, so we pulled the motor out with the transmission and everything, and we wanted to show you that all the cables, you can see all the wiring harness is still here. Okay, right there. So everything comes out that way, super easy. We just wanted to do an update, show you what it looks like. So uh, that will be all guys, uh, most of the Mercedes vehicles will be that way, thank you for watching, please subscribe, let's grow the channel together, be part of it, thank you for watching us.